My name is Amit Nethwani. I have the privilege of being the Chief Medical Officer and the Chief Digital Officer at Sanofi, a life science company. We're a life sciences company. We're one of the largest in the, in the world. And we develop a range of medicines from everything to do with vaccines, right through to rare diseases, as well as drugs for cancers. But we also have a division that specializes in consumer healthcare as well. So drugs you can buy over the counter or behind the counter in many parts of the world. My definition of digital health, and there are many, is the convergence of biological, engineering, and physical sciences with a singular focus to enhance patient well-being and personal care. Digital tools are an essential part of the future of life science companies. They can work in many ways. If you just take the experience of how we actually discover drugs using tools, the entire way that we can actually use technology to actually simulate diseases, find new targets, predict how drugs will work, right through to the process of developing the drugs. Those are the traditional ways that digital tools can truly change the way we work. However, if you were looking at it from a patient perspective, we can use digital tools to actually create new diagnostic markers, so what we call digital biomarkers. We can accompany our drugs with apps that can actually help them to actually perform better and actually support the patients from their symptoms perspective. We can even replace drugs today with digital technologies, right now called digital therapeutics. And we can also prevent diseases using technologies and behavioral coaching as well. So it is a whole range of, um, of ways that we can use technology for patients across the entire life cycle. So I do believe that with the regards to the future of healthcare, life science companies like Sanofi have to embrace technology and completely transform everything we do right from the way that we use technologies across the entire value chain, but as well as looking at new ways to apply technology in designing and understanding patients' outcomes more specifically and designing new technologies to actually assist them specifically as a new way. So it's not just drugs, but actually technologies that can improve patients and disease.